preach for you today and, uh, and share this worship, share this whole week, this whole time with you. Um, so um, frequently in my congregation, I tell the story through the eyes of one of the witnesses so that we can imagine the story as real for our lives. Často, když kážeme své zboru, se jim po obnerazce, tak vybrávám příběh, tak jak ho možná zažili v tehdejší dobový světkové a povídám to, tak jak to viděli v jejich očima. Vyhom to by také podobně viděli. And when I wrote the passage for today, I wondered what it must have been like for the wife of Cornelius. A když jsem si četla tady tento text, který máme dnes před sebou, tak jsem si říkala, co to asi mohlo být. So if you'll indulge me a little bit, uh, please take a moment and imagine as if we are friends of the early church, and today we are receiving a special visitor. Že se pán Bůh rozhodl, že při raní modlitbě 
our house. Já jsem z toho tak překvapená jako on a ještě víc mě šokovalo, když jsem slyšela, že manžel okamžitě poslal několik svých lidí, aby přivedli je Petra jako hosta do našeho domu. Petra, který byl jeden z Ježíšových učení. To our house. Do našeho domu. I, I didn't know what to do. What, what do we serve them? How, how do we receive them? Should we, should, should we wash his feet when he comes in the door? Or is it improper for any of us to touch them? In the flurry of it all, like, I couldn't remember any of their food. They were so hard to keep straight. I had never tried to learn them, but now I was going to have a Jew in my house. My house! And I was so sure we would just mess it all up in some way. So I found one of my Jewish servants and put her in charge of preparing the meal and preparing our house. What would this mean for us, I thought, for our neighbors, for all of Caesarea? Co tady tohle znamená? Co to znamená pro nás, naše soustry, pro celou Cezare? What was my husband doing, I thought? What was God doing? Co to mého manžela vůbec napadlo? Co to Pána Boha napadlo? Was it so wrong for us to worship the God of the Israelites that now we would receive the wrath of their God? Bylo to tak, že jsme se tak spletli, že jsme se tak minuli v tom, že jsme sloužili Izraelskému Bohu, že se na nás tedy měla. I was so afraid. Měla jsem takový strach. Days later, it seemed like years later, Peter arrived at the door with six other Jews of the way of Jesus. Po několika dnech já jsem měla pocit, že to jsou snad roky, dorazil Petr s dalšími šesti židy, s dalšími šesti následovníky cesty. Now there were more of them. Oh God, I pray, what will come of this? And then I heard Peter saying to my husband that God had shown him a vision too. Now we were followers of Jesus Christ and new creatures. It wouldn't be our eating habits or our language or our ancestry that proved we were children of God. It would be the Holy Spirit at work in our lives. Later, there were others who felt like they were on the outside of the reach of God. But they would hear our story, and they knew that God's message was for them too. Tak to bylo dál. Nešlo jenom po naši rodinu, ale objevovali se další, kteří měli pocit, že jsou někde na konci, na kraji, a nikdo o ně nemá zájem. A najednou slyšeli o nás, slyšeli nás. I heard said that people come into our lives for a reason, bringing something we must learn, and we are led to those who help us most to grow. If we let them, and we help them in return, well, I